Thank you for your interest in Godalming College. I hope this short presentation will help you to get a real sense of what a unique place Godalming College is. In this locality, you're really lucky. You're spoilt for choice as far as post-16 options are concerned, with school sixth forms, general further education colleges and other sixth form colleges like ours. It's important that you do your research and get a real sense of what is right for you. But obviously this presentation is going to focus in on why Godalming. Well look, first and foremost, we are specialists in 16 to 19 education. We don't have to worry about the Year 7 curriculum, the Year 10 mocks, we only focus in on this age group. The College will provide you with a fresh start in a more adult environment and we're a natural stepping stone between school and your next step, whatever that may be. And I think making a change at 16 helps students to be more confident when they have to make a change at 18 and progress on to their next step. Our college has a really strong emphasis on learning. Our mission is learning together for success and progression. And we not only want to help our students learn what they need to do as far as their courses are concerned, but also whilst they're here to develop and foster a love of learning because it's a really important, valuable life skill. Learning is important to us as a college as well. We want to learn to get better at what we do and how we provide for our students. In summary, our vision is to be a successful, vibrant learning community. Successful. We're really proud of the fact that consistently we achieve outstanding results with our students. The results you see on the screen there are not a one-off. Year on year, we achieve some of the very best performance in the country. Our A-level pass rate last summer was 99.3% and A star to C rate, 85.5%. That was at A level. At B tech, arguably an even stronger performance with 100% pass rate and the distinction star to merit rate being 96.7%. We're really proud of these results. They're some of the best in the country, as I said earlier, and we exceed national benchmarks by some country margin. Please do look at our website if you want to drill down and look at the individual results for uh, each subject. It's not just about the raw results though, it's really, really important that you consider how well an individual school or college does in terms of value added. And what that means is how well a school or college helps students to perform above their expectation in essence. So if a school or college is adding value, that means it's helping students to exceed what you would expect them to as far as their results are concerned. And students at Godalming perform even better than you would expect them to do based on their prior attainment level. This is measured by the Department for Education uh, Level 3 Value Added Analysis and we're above average on that measure. And on the A-Level Performance System measure, ALPS, we're in the top 10 providers in the country. Progression data, that is also a really good indicator of how well a school or college is doing. Before I talk about the data you can see on the screen there, you might recognise Max Bowden. He's a former Godalming College student, we're really proud of him. You may recognise him because he's currently starring in the BBC soap opera EastEnders. We were lucky enough that he came back to talk to some of our current students and we really value those links with our, with our former students coming back and imparting their knowledge of what it's like to work in the industry, what it's like to study at university. But looking at the data, the data there is from the Higher Education Statistics Agency and it tells us how well former Godalming College students do when they graduate. The data is from 2019 and 88.7% of former Godalming College students achieved a first or 2-1, which exceeds all the benchmarks there you can see for all types of provider. And to me, why I'm so proud of that data is it proves that their experience at Godalming helps students to be successful when they progress on to higher education. The love of learning that I talked about is really important and will help students as they progress to their next step. Finally, as far as success is concerned, a really proud moment for everybody connected with uh, Godalming College was at our recent Ofsted inspection, which happened in December 2019. We hadn't been inspected since 2008, 
but we were really delighted when Ofsted confirmed that once again we had retained our outstanding status. This is no mean feat because the new inspection framework is a much tougher one. So we're really proud that they recognise that what we provide for our students remains outstanding. Vibrant. We've put a lot of time, money and effort into ensuring our campus is fit for 21st education and the right environment for students to thrive in. Our wonderful campus is a mixture of old and new. It's not too big, it's not too small, and it has a range of state-of-the-art facilities to support high-quality teaching and learning. At the heart of the campus is our independent learning centre, which contains a fantastic range of resources to support studies. There are expert staff on hand to help and signpost students to resources, whether that be book-based or e-resources. There's a silent study area and plenty of um, computers for students to access during their private study time. IT, key part of everybody's lives, none more so than during this current pandemic. Godalming is no different. We look at ways continuously about how we can use technology to enhance our teaching and learning and develop our digital strategy. Sport. We have first-class facilities as far as sport is concerned. We have a sports centre, a gym that students can use, as well as state-of-the-art sports pitches just off the main campus. We're proud of our sporting success and the range of sports that students can get involved in. Last year, our men's hockey team were AOC national champions and our men's football team were runners-up in the English school's FA Cup final. We also place a lot of emphasis on the arts in the broadest sense. If students want to get involved, there's plenty of opportunities to do so. Each year, we run a fantastic range of drama productions that students can get involved in, as well as music concerts and performances. There really is something for everybody. Learning. I think uh, our curriculum offer is a real strength of what we provide for our students here at Godalming. Underpinning our curriculum design are the two principles of choice and breadth. Choice, we have a huge range of both A-level and B-tech courses from which students can choose from. And we have the ability to be able to put together pretty much any combination of subjects for students. But as well as choice, breadth is important to us as well. And we expect all students to take part in some form of enrichment alongside their core programme. I'll say a little bit more about our enrichment offer in just a moment. Another element to breadth in terms of what we provide for our students is our tutorial programme, which we entitle Shaping Futures. And that covers issues uh, and topics that are absolutely relevant to the 16 to 19 age group. But at the heart of our curriculum design, as you can see there on the slide, is our ability to put together a study programme that suits the individual needs, interests and abilities of each of our students. I mentioned enrichment, and I think this is something that is very unique to Godalming and something we're really proud of. We've done a lot of work to develop and evolve this over the last couple of years. This slide actually doesn't do our offer justice. I would urge you to go onto the website and drill down into the very many different options that are available to you. In short, we divide our enrichment offer into these three headings, plus explore. These are short courses that students can do. Essentially, they'll do one short course in the autumn term and one short course in the spring term. These courses provide students with the opportunity to develop a new skill, an area of interest, and possibly even develop and start to form uh, their progression plans along the way. There are no exams at the end of them. They just provide students with the opportunity, really, in essence, to enjoy learning for its own sake. We've structured and themed the, the offer, as you can see under there, plus Explore Umbrella, into business and tech development. Examples, of course, there would be investment society, communication, a college magazine, creative, uh, Photoshop courses, science and environmental. You could get involved in the Green and Godalming group, looking at the environmental issues around the campus. Ethical issues, you might want to learn more about human rights, health and well-being. Uh, you can take part in yoga. There's far more on offer that I could possibly say just in this presentation. So please do and go look at, at all of the Plus Explore courses available to you. Plus Active, 
This perhaps is the type of enrichment that you may well be more familiar with from school. The opportunities there for you to get involved with dance, drama, music, sport, Duke of Edinburgh. As well as that, plus qualifications. Now, there's a small suite of qualifications that you can see there. They are predominantly on offer to second years because we do expect students to continue to do some form of enrichment into their second year as well. Uh, and those small suite of qualifications, again, complement uh, and support the core programmes that students are studying. By far the most popular choice there on the screen that you can see is something called the Extended Project Qualification, EPQ, and that's where students can get to pick uh, an area of interest, form a research hypothesis and write that up into a 5,000 word report or produce uh, an artefact. Our greatest resource at college are our wonderful staff. We have expert teachers who are specialists in their field, but also specialists in the delivery of the A-level and B-Tech specifications that we have on offer. They're highly committed and enjoy working with the 16 to 19 age group. I talked earlier about our emphasis on learning, and we also place a strong emphasis linked to that in terms of learning to be better at teaching and learning. We run regular teaching and learning workshops for staff and we encourage staff to keep in tune with the latest research as far as pedagogy is concerned. Community. The college community spirit is really evident at Godalming. We pride ourselves on our friendly, vibrant atmosphere. It's what makes our college special. There's a real team ethos here with students and staff working in partnership in order to enable our students to achieve their potential. Students call staff by their first name, which is part of that adult environment. We value our role in the local community too. We work with other local schools, colleges, employers and universities. And we look to give back to the local community through fundraising and volunteering work that our students do as well. There's a lot of support for students. Part of the process of learning is that sometimes we make mistakes and realising that that's okay. And there's a huge support network here to guide and help students along the way. All of our students will have a personal tutor who will look after them for the two years that they're here at college. They will meet with that tutor every week and they will first of all focus on helping students settle into college right through to helping them with their application for their next step, whether that be higher education, apprenticeship or employment. Tutors will also have one-to-ones along the way with their students to help review their progress and make sure that they're keeping on track. We have a dedicated and specialist career service with highly qualified staff on hand to provide individual careers advice and guidance. We also have an Aspire programme to support students who are applying to competitive destinations such as Oxbridge or Medicine or onto Art Foundation, drama schools, music conservatoires and so on. There's also our excellent learning support department, who not only provide for our students who have a specific learning need, but are available to all students should they need help with their studies. Mental health and wellbeing is also really important to us. We work hard with our students to develop their resilience, but we also have a team of counsellors on hand on a weekly basis to help students should they need to access this. I hope this presentation has given you a real sense of what Godalming is all about. We would really welcome an application for you. There's information there on the screen about our application process. Applications are now open. Please again look at our website for further details uh, about how to make that application, but also to look for much more information than I've been able to cover in this presentation. I do hope that this has been useful. I really thank you for your interest in the College and I look forward to welcoming you to Godalming in the not too distant future. Thank you.